Hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough. No wasting time. In fact, we're already facing the right direction. Since you're so late, I've been mulling over my deck for so long. Come on, let's bail! I wanna begin right away! Whoa, 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 calm down there. Calm down there. Because you're being so pushy, I'm gonna say no. If you don't intend to fight against me, please don't speak to me! Well, I never. Luckily for you, I do intend. I just wanted to see your other dialogue. What is it? Are you looking to battle with me? I'm just trying to get some 4th edition booster packs. Assault. Oh, that explains it. That's why you want to do some battles. But wait! I've never been known to give up booster packs, have I? Or even cards, for that matter, after losing. Hmm. Hmm. Do I? And I don't know it? Hopefully not. Anyway, let's do it all. Let's make it a quickie. Four prize cards should do the trick! Bellamaniac! Deck. <laughs> <laughs> so we shuffle, we draw seven, we know how this goes, we've done it many times, and we might have already won with that. <laughs> it's like there, I don't know, we'll see. Four prize cards, of course, as stated. I do not go first. Sad face, sad face. I will be going for the... Alright. Will it be doubled? It will not be! That works in my favor. But I will be able to guarantee my doubling, assuming I'm not energy removaled. But yeah, Swords Dance is a guaranteed thing. No coin flip. You know, unlike the focus energy, so we should be good. Uh, she's probably yeah, she's probably counting on me not being able to attack. But little does she know, I have the double colorless. <laughs> um, should I? I don't think I have to defend the... Yeah, I don't, I don't think. I don't think. <laughs> Unless she's got some double colorless surprise of her own somewhere. I, I don't know. I don't think so. I don't think so. I think she would have probably set that up already. Maybe. Maybe. Like, instead of going for the matchup, because I got the sight... Yeah. Because <laughs> I got the sight that she's... I would have thought that she would have thought, you know, lick a tongue. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Tuttleless Pokemon. Anyway. <laughs> uh, uh, yeah, I'll go for the Spearow. Pop that Venonat out there. And attack with the Slash. Not going for a double here because it, it's still going to take two turns regardless. I only use the double when I need to use the double, basically. Like if I have to skip a turn for some reason otherwise, and I can just use that turn to double on the next turn. No paralysis! And that's, uh, yeah, but <laughs> yeah, that's another thing about this here is that, um, since, yeah, if I Swords Dance, I have to hold for two tails in a row, I'm not that lucky. <laughs> anyway, her turn once again. No healing, no defending. And not even paralysis. Hmm. 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 This might not be her game. <laughs> I'll just go and power up for a potential Venonoth and grab a Pride's card, and sure enough, I got a Venomoth. I uh, she might be going for oh okay. I was gonna say she might be going for actually damaging the Scyther, but you know what I'm gonna do. Because I can do probably more damage with the Venomoth using the power. Oh no, that's oh no, that's right, that's right. Yeah, I thought it was four energy for a second there. I, okay, because <laughs> I thought I could either cause paralysis and then do more damage on the next turn without her being kind of stuck, or I'll poison and I'll even do more damage in general. So yeah, we'll see how things go with that. <laughs> <laughs> I just didn't want her to kind of wipe out my Venomoth that quickly and all like that. You know what I mean? <laughs> uh, yeah, Rainbow Powder. I was actually hoping for a Heads there, but that'll work too, because if she doesn't switch out the Hitmonlee, she will be forced to allow it to be knocked out, basically. We'll see what she does. We shall see. Oh, she did a switch, okay. <laughs> yeah, because I'm getting kind of low on the prize cards, so... She was probably like, eh, eh, probably should kind of prevent that from happening. <laughs> yeah, she's not really doing much of anything in general here, so I don't know if she just got bad draws. Like, I'm feeling like I should give her another shot if this doesn't go 
her way in some fashion soon. Come on, Tails. That's what I was looking for, because that'll knock out the Dodo with the poison. And yeah, it's like I'm getting all luck for once. <laughs> I'm not used to that at all. She puts the uh, sweatband over her eyes. <laughs> and she's mainly going to be going for the bench Pokemon. Yeah, because otherwise she's not going to be able to do anything with the Mach Punch to Venomoth, so yeah. Um, plus power could could very well be game. Uh, wait, don't I? Yeah, I do have a gust of wind. <laughs> Let's just put her out of her misery. <laughs> just start a new game with her. <laughs> yeah, I don't, I don't think her deck has been utilized to its full potential here, because I, th I think she had a bad shuffle. And that's one of the things that I like to do with the games. I like to try and show how to beat opponents at their fullest potential. I lost. My chaining is not enough. A booster pack reward is given to the victor, as always. But yeah, the, the thing about it is that you wouldn't typically expect that sort of thing to happen on every game. So it's not very walkthrough friendly when I just win that easily, you know? <laughs> it's just like... Gotta, gotta have some struggle to show the full potential of the opponent. Training is hard, but battling is quite fun. Uh, oh, same dialogue? Okay. Alright. Your second and probably last chance! Here we go! <laughs> we'll see. Now, now watch her just destroy me this time. Uh, she may very well. I'll put off Spiro though, just in case. But yeah, I don't have that much power to go by here, so she could very well start stretch-kicking me to doom, but we'll see. Uh, yeah, we're gonna go recycle energy on the Spearow, in case things go awry, because uh, then it'll come back to my hand. And look at that, she's got nothing on her bench again. I, I, I shouldn't say again, it's just, <laughs> it's just... I mean, it's one of those sorts of situations where... Yeah, um... Third battle it is. <laughs> I'm so sorry, Jessica, I'm so sorry. <laughs> Alright, let's see what we get in the booster, though. At least we're getting cards out of this. Uh, Kabutops, very low HP for its high energy costs. Yeah, it's like you power it up on the bench, and it's also got very specific energy costs. All fighting. That absorb does, uh, it can do up to... Or at least normally. I mean, it can do up to 80 damage if the opponent has weaknesses to it, but then it'll recover 40, but you know, with Kabutops having such low HP, it's kind of kind of on the iffy side, but anyway. <laughs> Let's see what else we get. Okay. Pinning Sour, but it's very hard. <laughs> Alright. Really, your last chance. Really, surely, you're like... <laughs> uh, oh, uh, I don't have any energy, but I have the Professor Oak. How about we go Bulbasaur, because I can plus power, and then Venonat, and then just like immediately uh, Professor Oak after using the plus power to get some energy. Uh, well, I was going to say, well, maybe if I'll get an energy, we'll see how things turn out. But, uh, should I hold... Because I got... I, I do want the energy, of course. <laughs> you know, you know, and she's a, she's got no bench. To, okay, I was, I was gonna say she's got no bench again. I just noticed. <laughs> oh, jeez. Yeah, maybe maybe it's just not her day. <laughs> just not her day. Oh, she got two heads there, so that, that's kind of her day. But I'm gonna do this, and then and a plus power. And I'm gonna defend. The Bulbasaur to boot, and oh, the Professor Oak to boot! <laughs> so I'll be able to just knock out the dull duel very quickly. Well, I got a Bill to boot. Ivysaur... No, 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 I'll go with the Razor Leaf plan. Because I can't do that much damage with the Ivysaur right away. I mean, yeah, I could do a little healing, but... Uh, it's just one of those sorts of dealios where this is how I would normally play, you know? <laughs> And you're gonna go for the bench Pokemon. It worked, so 10 damage goes to something. I don't know what she's gonna pick though. Venonat, okay. Um, I should probably do that, just give it more HP in general. Probably do that. 
probably do that as well. You know, if I had another plus power, you know? You know? <laughs> yeah, I'm just trying to kind of nick off as much damage. Can you... I, I can't believe this. Three three games in a row. This, this can't be. This just can't be. <laughs> All right, you know what? I'll just go over to Mitch. <laughs> I'll, I'll consider rebattling you later when you're having a better day. How, how about that? <laughs> I lost. My chain is not enough. A boost of Packers Ward is given to the victors always. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I don't know if it has to do with your training. It has to do with your shuffles. Uh, Alright. Uh huh. <laughs> Thanks to your help on GR Island, I could safely return here. But in the heat of battle, there's no room for kindness or manners. Would you like to fight me to get that adrenaline pumping? No. Nope. Uh, that's the way you want it, so be it. What a shame. You may have rescued me before, but that won't change how I fight you! We're fighting with live weapons! Come at me, Mint! Whoa! Holy moly, I didn't know we were using guns for this. Uh, unless you mean the guns are our fists. Six prize cards, now begin! Come on, Mint! <laughs> Surging Iron Fist deck! Yeah, it is the fists! <laughs> yeah, I know, that was coming. Alright, so, let's see if Mitch has better luck than she has. It's like the game is just throwing me wins left and right. Uh, I'll start with Bulbasaur and save the Venonath to the Venonoth combo for later on, because, you know, resistances and whatnot. So, we'll see. I go first! Yay! Ooh, Hitmonlee. That Hitmonlee could... You have no bench, Pokemon! <laughs> oh, come on! I'm really hoping you get something here. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let's just tackle for now and OP draws a basic. Please, for the love of our CS, get a basic. <laughs> oh no, but it's like if I get plus power, it's over! At least I don't, yeah, I don't have plus, yeah, I don't have plus power right now. Uh, let's just go for the Razor Leaf, I suppose. <laughs> Come on, Mitch! Okay, is he thumbed up? Yes! He's got to look it's on. <laughs> we ne never know, never know when I was cheer for my opponent. <laughs> he just needs one heads to knock out my uh, Bulbasaur. So yeah, that was probably the good move to use the plus power just in case. All right, <laughs> he's in this. He is in this. <laughs> gonna plop that on the Venonat. I'm f yeah, Venonat. I was gonna say. Venomoth. I thought I mis made a mistake, but no, no. I just want to evolve into Venomoth. Now, I don't know uh, if I want to... Because, yeah, yeah, I don't... Should, should I put something on the bench? I don't know if I should, really. I probably should, just in case, but I was thinking I should just use a Defender. But yeah, just, just in case, and then call it a turn. But yeah, I was thinking you might do some bench attack shenanigans. Oh yeah, he's got the psychic Pokemon to battle the psychics that are is that his fighting Pokemon are weak against, and the neutral damage also stops the weakness and resistances. So yeah, he's uh he's actually in good shape now, because now, now I can't use my resistances as well. <laughs> um I'm definitely gonna plop that on there. Uh yeah, tornado gust, and then He's going to choose the Mr. Mime. I'm going to choose the Spiro. So I'll keep my Venomoth safe. Sort of. Because <laughs> remember, you can still do bench attack shenanigans. And also, since that Mr. Mime is uh, out, it'll stop that neutral damage thing from going on. Oh, he's not really. Interesting. I was going to say, he's not attacking. Hmm. I wonder if I should go with the Spiro Firo. Because <laughs> that, 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 yeah, because if I can surprise knock out that Mr. Mime, he won't be able to pull off the weakness and resistance elimination Telio, you know? Ooh, Hitmonchan, that's gonna be a thing against him. <laughs> um, yeah, we're gonna do that. 
And we're gonna pretend... <laughs> we're gonna pretend we don't have Firo in hand, okay? <laughs> Just to kind of give him a surprise. How does that sound? Okay. Uh, I thought he might decide to switch, or, yeah, I, I don't know. Uh, yeah, I think I'm gonna... Well, um, actually, ooh, I don't know, actually. Should I even evolve the Fearow? Because I don't want to drill dive and not be able to attack. I mean, I could get a head coin flip, but... <laughs> I think I'm actually good with the Spearow, in all honesty. At the very least, I'm going to do this, so... Anyway, let's just wing attack and knock out Mr. Mind with. Yeah, I don't think he can do 40 damage to my Spearow with anything he's got right now. At least chances are he doesn't, so... We'll see. And he's powering up the Hitmonchan, maybe doing 10 more? No. So yeah, if he were be able to knock out the Spearow, it would be very rare, because he'd have to get a head flip, plus have a plus power on top of that. Yeah, chances are pretty low. And we're gonna go... Firo? And... Hmm... I was thinking maybe I should gust of wind that Hitmonchan into play to start nicking away at it. Because I because anything can knock... I mean, anything that I have can attack the Lickitung. Uh... Although, maybe I should save the Firo for... for later. Let's just drill... Uh, I mean, quick attack for now, excuse me, and then drill dive after that, just to kind of guarantee... Well, no, no, I can't possibly... Ah, the coin flips, I was going to say, because it does 50 damage, I would guarantee the knockout, but no, no, that, that coin flip could be a factor. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, man. <laughs> um, well, I could switch to the Venomoth. Eh, well, I don't know. I don't know, maybe I'm overthinking this current scenario. <laughs> How about we go for the drill dive? Head please, heads please, yeah baby! <laughs> that will do. That will do. Yeah, it's like, I'm having all the good luck today, not the opponents. <laughs> I, I cannot believe this is happening, because it's usually me getting all the tails and them getting all the heads. Not today. Not today. <laughs> and we're gonna go with the Venomoth. And then we're gonna go. Ooh, I was gonna say we're gonna. I was gonna attach some other sort of energy, but I guess the recycle will do. And what if I should? Should I plus power? I, nah, I don't think so because that's gonna leave it with 50 HP even with the poison. So let's just go for either or. Paralysis is pretty nice. And I guess I'll try and surprise plus power poison on the next turn then. Because maybe, maybe that'll put him in a pickle. And, uh, see how that turns out as a result. And I'm getting a bunch of Pokemon, which I could trade, but I don't know what to trade for when I don't have the energy, you know? You know? I mean, I guess I could evolve to, uh, Ivysaur later, but I don't have the energy to power up the Ivysaur, you know what I mean? <laughs> anyway, Rainbow Powder, come on Tails, come on Tails, come on Tails, yeah! <laughs> See? I'm even calling the coin flips! It's just my day, I guess. <laughs> and that knocks out the Lickitung. Kangaskhan is a go-go. Here we go-go. <laughs> Dizzy Punch. Can it do 20 damage? Can it do any damage? No, it can't! I can't believe today! <laughs> Impossible! <laughs> Alright, let's go I'll do that. You know what, I'll just plop that on there for kicks. In case of the, uh... I guess you could say stretch kick bench attacks. This uh, sort of deal that fighting Pokemon like to do in that nothing can hide from the fighters. Nothing. Possibly. <laughs> <laughs> so, you know, giving them more HP is kind of helpful. Ooh, full heal! I was not expecting that. Um, uh, Mach Punch! Ooh! <laughs> That's okay. We still have other attackers coming your way. Um, uh, I should probably put the other Scyther down there. I wonder if I should get another Venonat Venomoth going. Maybe? I suppose I could. It wouldn't hurt, I think, but... 
kind of thin out the, the evolutions and certain lines and stuff like that, so to speak. And we got Paralysis this time, which is probably the more ideal of the two, because then it'll prevent Kangaskhan from attacking. Oh, we got something that he likes. It was an energy card! I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what it was. Uh, but now I'm hoping for Tails for Poison. But in the meantime, I'm just going to set up the Scyther. See, so yeah, I'm going to go for the Rainbow Powder. There it is! Unbelievable! Just unbelievable! <laughs> I... This... This is, like, unprecedented! We've gone over 30 parts of me having terrible luck, and then we have this part. <laughs> just me destroying everything! <laughs> <laughs> eh, poison would be nice, but uh, well, I, I can deal with paralysis as well. But yeah, I was gonna say poison because it will, it will potentially put him in a pickle. But come to think of it, maybe paralysis would be better because then he can't switch out. And then if I get poison on the next coin flip, then it'll be game over because you know he won't be able to switch out at all. So tails, no way. <laughs> all right, yeah, this is. It's definitely my day. <laughs> Just call it at that. <laughs> yeah, so I don't think if I battled Jessica a hundred more times today it would help her. <laughs> that was an excellent defeat. These are yours for winning. Thank you. <laughs> oh, jeez. I got the wheezings of the extendeds. And, okay. And another flight. What might it be? Hmm. Okay. <laughs> when I fight against you, I always get some good training out of it. Uh, you may have rescued me before. Uh, uh, nope. Okay, I just wanted to see if you got any new dialogue. Alright. With that, I'm going to end off the part here. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed. And I'll see you in the next part. When maybe my luck will continue. Though I wouldn't count on it. This was very rare for me. 